Now, folks, Florida has reported 134,506 new COVID-19 cases over the last week. In just under two weeks, six unvaccinated uh, members of the same church contracted COVID-19 and died in Jacksonville, Florida. Currently, 15 to 20 members from the church are in the hospital. The church hosted a free vaccination clinic on Sunday for those who wanted to get vaccinated. But this thing goes even deeper than that, folks. Uh, what we're seeing is a number of companies, law firms and others now requiring their workers to be fully vaccinated. The NFL is taking a very strong stand uh, when it comes to this issue as well. Yet you still have players like uh, in Minnesota Vikings quarterback Kirk Cousins who said that he will not take it. And then he said he will take himself as, as, as best possible, including plexiglass. Well, it's a little hard for you to have plexiglass surrounding you if you're playing on the field. Uh, Lamar Jackson, who plays for the Baltimore Ravens, their star quarterback, he's tested positive for COVID, and he still says he's unsure if he's going to take the vaccine. You, you've tested positive twice. We are seeing, folks, uh, more and more of these cases. We're seeing uh, in um, uh, hospitals where children uh, are dying uh, as a result of getting uh, this Delta variant. It is causing significant issues all across uh, this country. And so we've been keeping up uh, with a lot of the folks who've been following this. More and more people also uh, are posting uh, all types of uh, videos, things, uh, things of that nature, uh, in order uh, for people to understand what's going on. Uh, we, we've had on the show before, uh, of course, uh, the brother out of Arizona. Uh, he uh, 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 goes by Cle uh, Clevon MD. Uh, this is what he actually uh, posts on his uh, page, on his uh, Twitter page. He has an ongoing graphic. Guys, let me know if y'all can see it. Uh, for some all right, uh, we're going to figure out what's going on here. Uh, I want to pull that up because um, it, it really jumps jumped out at me. Um, and so let me just get this straight here. I want to make, I want you to see this. Uh, what he does is he posts uh, ongoing messages, ongoing messages uh, on his social media account with regards to um, uh, COVID, what's happening uh, with uh, COVID. And if you, it goes by uh, Clavon, C-L-E-A-V-O-N uh, underscore M-D. And so uh, what he does is he, um, I got it, Anthony. I, um, I think this is going to be the fix right here. Um, let's see if this works. I got it. We're up. So uh, we're sh I want to show you this here. So th this is this, when he's going by, you go to the hashtag, souls lost to COVID, souls lost to COVID. Uh, and what he does is he posts a lot of these items. They are, they are, they are teachers, they are doctors. Uh, I saw a story the other day, a uh, post the other day uh, of a gentleman who is an architect in Arkansas. Um, he felt he was healthy, 49 years old, did not want take the vaccine, um, but he's now dead and it's causing a lot of conversation in the community where he lives uh, because uh, people are now uh, talking about it and it's now gotten their attention. Uh, his wife actually gave a comment where she said that now people realize this is an issue. Uh, by saying that uh, now they realize it comes to their doorsteps. Uh, you know, this says a whole lot, folks, uh, as well. It's time to be smart. When we control our institutions, we win. We win. This is the most important news show on television of any racial background. Y'all put two, three, four, five, 10, 15, 20, 30 dollars on this and keep this going. What you've done, Roland, since this crisis came out in full bloom. Anybody watching this, tell your friends, go back and look at the last two weeks, especially of Roland Martin Unfiltered. I mean, hell, go back and look at the last two days. You've had sitting United States senators today, Klobuchar and Harris. Whatever you have that you have, you can bring to Roland Martin Unfiltered to support it, please do, because this information may literally save your life. Watch Roland Martin Unfiltered daily at 6 p.m. Eastern on YouTube, Facebook, or Periscope, or go to RolandMartinUnfiltered.com. Support the Roland Martin Unfiltered Daily Digital Show by going to RolandMartinUnfiltered.com. Our goal is to get 20,000 of our fans contributing 50 bucks each for the whole year. You can make this possible. RolandMartinUnfiltered.com.